been booting New Jersey at the Torn, I think it's a Torn County Park. And <clears throat> I don't know if you can see just past me here, but there's a beautiful kind of skyline. We're at the top of, I don't know, we're about a thousand feet up. Absolutely beautiful. And on the other side, you can see skyline of New York City. Kind of gorgeous. And I was reading last night in uh, Matthew 6, verse 33 and 34 where it says seek the kingdom of God above all else and live righteously and he will give you everything you need so don't worry about tomorrow for tomorrow will bring its own worries today's troubles are enough for today and I was thinking about worry and how we worry and what worry does to us and there was this devotion that I was reading and the author said, simply stated, worry is our inability to trust God. And that hit me like so hard. I was like, man, that is kind of incredibly uh, accurate and so true, right? Like we get so wrapped up in our own day to day that we get so stuck in our worry, our fear, our anxiety, our stress. And I know that I keep hitting on this, but I'm only hitting on it because so many people have responded saying that's what they're struggling with. I wrote this, I said, our worry, our fear, our insecurities, God is calling us deeper and deeper to him, asking us to trust him for he is our good father, right? He is our father who will take care of us. He knows what's best for us. He knows our needs and our wants, our dreams and our desires, but trust and faith are these kind of intangible, kind of inexplicable things. And we wander around it sometimes, right? I wrote this, we wander around it we dabble in it, but we're afraid to surrender to it. And God is asking for complete and utter surrender, right? He's just asking for us to just have faith and to trust him more. And I'm finding that the more and more that I get into this full-timeness of my ministry, it just, it's so hard to trust and have faith in God that everything is going to be okay right ah uh, man it's so hard and i i hope that you guys hear it in my voice and my heart like i'm just seeking him so deeply and yet i'm still continuing to hold on to my own like humanly my own human desires right like i think i got this god but can you help me over here or there's this little thing over here that needs some help and but I just need to try to find a way to surrender to all of it. Like not just little things or big things. I mean, the big things are the hard part, right? It's so hard to surrender the big stuff. Like what, what's gonna happen tomorrow? We're so worried about what's gonna happen tomorrow and the next day and the next day. And God is like, hey, just worry about today. Like today, has so much going on and there's so much that I have in store for you is what he's saying to us and we're just so ah we get so wrapped up in our own selves that we have a hard time surrendering so today I'm out here it's beautiful it's like a 70 de degree day um, man it's absolutely gorgeous and I'm just talking to God I'm just saying like hey I need help with my faith. I need help with my trust. I need help with kind of just letting go of where I'm gonna be tomorrow. And I just need help in surrendering today to Him. So I don't know if you're feeling that way or not. I mean, maybe write in the comments how we can pray for you, what we can do for you, and 
how we can get involved, but today just surrender. Just work on little acts of surrender. And I'm hoping that the little acts of surrender will kind of lead to bigger acts of surrender and faith and trust and honesty and all of that stuff that God is just desiring for us to have so that we can have a more fulfilled relationship with Him, if that makes sense. But today, let's work on trust. Let's work on, work on surrender. Let's work on hope in Him and work on all of that together. All right, so I'll take a few shots around here. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, man, God, we just pray today for surrender. We pray for hope. We pray for faith and trust, God, that we would be have the ability to surrender to you, surrender more to you. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next one.